Example 14. Evaluate the integral. They don't say we have to use substitution, so we kind of have to know that we're going to have to use substitution. The integral of 7e to the 7t divided by 9 plus e to the 7t. So I'm not sure exactly which one should be u. Kind of think it might need to be this whole thing. Let's see. If u is 9 plus e to the 7t, then the derivative of u with respect to t is e to the 7t times 7. So look, that's du over dt is 7e to the 7t. And so I think I made the right decision. Let's substitute what we know. This whole thing was my u. And for my dt, well, I need to solve this for dt. Let's see. That's going to be times dt. That's going to be times dt. So du is 7e7t times dt. I'm going to divide both sides by 7e to the 7t. And that's what I want to put in for dt. du over 7e to the 7t. So du over 7e to the 7t. And so look, here's the 7e to the 7t. Well, those are going to divide out. And I'm going to get the integral of du over u. Everything's in terms of u's now. So this is the integral of 1 over u du. And that's the only one where I can't use the, x, the power rule and change that u to the negative 1. That's the natural log of the absolute value of u plus c. So my final answer is the natural log of 9 plus e to the 7t, and that's in absolute value bars, plus c. Now, this is always positive, and this is always positive. So here's another one where I don't have to have the absolute value bars because that is definitely always positive. So it's the natural log of 9 plus e to the 7t plus c.